Hi guys, Derpy Jones here and uh, welcome to another redstone video. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you my secret room underneath a clock. And by the way, I put down the link in the description of my schedule uploading videos. So yeah, and I know this is very late for you and the uh, yeah, let's crack in. Okay, as you can see, this is the actual clock itself and there's a clock symbol there and when I go inside and there you go and there's nothing in there and when I get inside, as you can see, then close the door and no one's know that it have a secret room here. Just get a redstone torch and place down right here and there you go. As you can see, it is very easy and get inside, get your cookie of love and have a great day right down here and actually I have a button right down here to goes up as you can see when I push it and there you go, nice and easy. Oops, I do I wanna mention, you can place a redstone torch here on the wall as you can see when I place it but it doesn't break so it is very derpy and do not test this out so just come inside push this button just for a while and there you go let's take a look at the redstone behind it okay as you can see this is the redstone behind it or actually this is the redstone all of and it is only four wide and i think on this side it is only three wide and as you can see it is very compact and here is the torch activation key and by the way i made a video on this maybe on last video or second or third last video i think just i put down the link in the description of that video and that is the torch activation key and make sure to check it out and there you go let's continue here as you can see when i place a redstone torch and the redstone torch not connected to the piston and when i place my wall block and as you can see oh my goodness i think it's a bud nope and hmm and all of this is triple extender as you can see this is the circuit and it is very small too and I run into a T flip flop as you can see it's a T flip flop right here and by the way also I put down the link in the description of my very old video I have a 10 designs of T flip flop you can check it out too and uh, yeah let's crack in with the tutorial okay wanna get started with a 4 by 3 spacing as you can see and you're also gonna need to dig down at least nine and as you can see that is my floor block the sandstone and let's start it just place a three block right here and a three piston facing upward with a slam block on his face with a two block here and my jungle wood as you can see it is a jungle wood or whatever you want and here place a block and a repeater on three ticks delay with a block behind it and block here and a repeater on four tick and block up like so and place a block here and with a repeater on four tick delay with the redstone dust and here we need a immovable object as you can see I'm using a obsidian because of the slime block and place a repeater and a redstone dust behind it and that is the triple extender done as you can see when i flick the lever and it is much on the floor and actually you can break this if you want it is very annoying like so and when i flip it up and there you go that is the triple extender okay let's continue here just oops Where's my lever go? Oh my goodness, I broke it. So get my lever and flick it up for some reason and come on here and this your floor lever and as you can see just cover it up. I'm using a sandstone 
because it is my favorite and it so looks awesome and place your wall block just like so and as you can see this is the wall and this is the floor just one up here and this is your torch placement activation key and come on the back and place a sticky piston with the redstone block and as you can see this is your piston and when I place a redstone torch here and there you go it extend so that is very awesome okay just place the redstone torch just for a while and here place a block down my red input so place a repeater as you can see the repeater turn on and place a dropper facing upward just like so and a dropper facing into this way as you can see it facing into this way and place a hopper facing into this dropper facing upward and it's going on here if this dropper shoot out the item it will go into this dropper and shoot out will go in this hopper and make it round and round and place a compactor here just fa facing away into that dropper and place a block in front of it and down here you can break that and place a block down here like so and a two redstone dust right there with the redstone torch here and two black down with the redstone torch as you can see and place a redstone dust there and a redstone torch here and that should be it so as you can see and by the way place a useless item I'm using a diamond chest plate and it has to be a non stackable because of this two redstone dust here we need a two signal strength and there you go let's test it out just I will stand here and place a torch oops what happened wow what happened here and oops just flick this lever up and there you go nice and easy okay next thing get your obsidian and place a obsidian here because of the slime blocks and right here also in there and wrap it around like so and there you go and one here and one up and that should be it just cover this up just like so and one here and also right here and there and finally here and there you go let's do the button or the up sequence or whatever you want to call it and place a button right there and come on the back just find the button and place a redstone torch on the back of it and place a block on top with a block here redstone dust as you can see it's turned on and place a block there with the redstone torch here as you can see this torch will power this block and which power this piston and which power this two flip flop right here because of this redstone block here and let's test it out just get in here and this is done on here block and place push the button and there you go it is fully working okay let's do the clock itself and just get the item on my hotbar and just come on the um, jungle wood as you can see the torch activation key and get your spruce door and place down right here and and also here as you can see it's all symmetrical and just close it it's like so and place a jungle wood stair right here and you can break this too if you want that's not needed and place a jungle door there as you can see this is the actual clock itself and you can place a door whatever you want here and there you go and let's set it up on inside just I will place a gold block and a iron here with the clock 
as you can see this is the hand of the clock and this is the tick tock tick tock kind of thing and the bad news is you can get inside perfectly as you can see I'm running now and you can place a redstone torch because of this iron frame right here so what did I do is I just placed a iron frame on the top and a the gold, gold block so let's test it out just get inside place a redstone torch and there you go and by the way you can do whatever you want here it's all yours be creative okay just push this button and there you go that is my secret room underneath a clock and sorry if my voice is very different for now and that uh, yeah because i'm very sick and that is pretty much it please leave a like and subscribe stay tuned with my newest video all right guys peace Boop.